right, what's up guys? Larry here, late one today in Iron Heaven. Uh, vlog Simber, day number 12, and it is a leg day. Um, so seeing that I'm here late, Jim has uh, a bit of a crowd in here. I really don't feel like fighting it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do what is the Ed Koo uh, Giant Set of Death. Uh, I've done this before. It's a very, this is probably the hardest, hardest uh, leg workout you'll probably ever do to close out the year. So if you're watching, thank Ed Koo for this one. If you're watching, let me know if you try it. Uh, click, in, click that like and subscribe button. Um, so I do a little bit of a variation. Uh, I do the main work that he puts out and uh, I'll put that workout up and but I also add in some hamstring curls and some glute work obviously to kind of round it out but the giant set for quads is absolutely absolutely brutal so it, things to keep in mind while you're doing it is one if you're new to it or um, if you're like me you only do it rarely he calls for five giant set rounds. You're not gonna be able to make it through five rounds. I'll tell you that right now. You're not gonna be able to make it through. Uh, number two, uh, I wouldn't do this on any type of pre-workout or caffeine induced uh, stimulant. What I would do is I would just come in cold like I'm doing right now and you know just hammer it out and go home. So with that being said, um, you're gonna go, we're gonna do it, and uh, we're gonna really, really work hard in the limited time that we have. And go home, get some food, and rest up. Cause we got back day tomorrow around this time, so no time to waste, so let's get it. All right, so with today's workout, which will pop up shortly on your screen, what the goal was is maximum blood into the muscle maximum stimulation without a whole bunch of load now i screwed up i i only did two working sets of leg extensions i read that wrong but if it was five i definitely would not have made it through three rounds of uh the giant set so ed constructed this if you don't follow ed Koo on instagram uh, I highly advise that you do. He is a, a great trove of knowledge when it comes to uh, training and uh, investing. He's also an investor and youth football coach. So uh, those are some things to think about uh, when you're adding him on the gram. But this workout was really tough, really, really had to be mentally into it. I'm proceeding the workout with hamstrings and with glutes. Now, that probably may have taken away some of the energy I needed for some of the main work when it came to hitting quadriceps, but I, I don't do any leg workout these days uh, without doing hamstrings and glutes first. So uh, it was rough. I hit failure on some parts earlier than expected, uh, but I powered through three sets. So maybe next week I'll try it again and we'll get through four with maybe a little bit heavier weight weight. But what I would like is instead of increasing the load too much, I like much more movement efficiency and consistency of reps, meaning that I stay with the reps and not have to pause and turn it into a mile rep set. So that's what I'm thinking for next week. We'll see. Uh, it's a good way to get in and out of the gym. You know, like I said, I've been with the kids all day, so I was a little tired. But also at the end of the day, you still got to get work done. So there we go. Enjoy the workout and try it if you dare.
Okay, all done. Sorry for the weird angle. I'm tired and it's late and I'm ready to go home. So made it through three giant sets. He prescribes five, but I'm just not there yet. I may give this a stab next week, I'm not sure. I'll talk to him, see what he thinks. Uh, right now my my leg training, my training in general isn't like super set in stone, so I allow for fluidity and, and shit to come in and out whenever I feel like it. Uh, and when my body's a little more beat up, I'll probably just take another D-low. So Ramadan's three months away, so I'll probably uh, do that here pretty soon. Train really hard the last two months before we go into the holy month, and then you know that holy month is nothing but really just a lot of a lot of systemic conditioning. Uh, probably do some mobility work and uh, a little extra cardio, get some fluff off, and then when we come back, um, slowly build back up the volume, and then just go from there. But this giant set workout is one of the hardest workouts I've ever. I've ever ever done um, you know I'm more of a brute force type of guy when it comes to lifting so um, it, it's just one of those things you have to really really power through and uh, I probably could have got four sets today but it's late it's already past 11 and I just want to go home and eat and go to sleep you know so because uh, I got back day tomorrow and I have the kids all day tomorrow too so uh, yeah, that's it, man. Uh, vlog Simber, uh, day number, whatever it is, I can't think right now. But um, yeah, I'm just excited to be here. Love the gym, excited to be in the gym. You know, excited to just have some days off with my family, even though they're my normal off days. So, you know, that's it. Just uh, the average working man, bodybuilding dad, right? So, you know, I do what I can. Um, hopefully we're approaching the midway point in my in my uh, little experiment of trying to put out a video a day uh, slipping up here and there but I hope you guys are getting something out of it if you are great if you aren't I mean that's fine too but if you are getting something out of it I, I hope you're sharing it I hope you're enjoying it and I hope you're I hope you're absorbing what I'm putting out so with that being said uh, we're gonna rest up get ready for back and uh, I'll bring back to you I don't know. It'll come though. It'll come. So, y'all have a great night, guys. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, we'll probably be at Bob's tomorrow. So, just to let you know, uh, we'll probably be at Bob's. So, let's get it. <laughs>